channel. If you're new here, it's your girl Christine Yell. And if you're not new here, welcome back. I'll be on it always, always Today is going to be just an average, regular day in my life. The weather is very gloomy. I'm really not even in the mood to be doing a lot today, and I'm off, so I kind of want to use this off day to just honestly do whatever I want for real. There is some things that I still need to get done, but for the most part, I'm not really going to be doing a whole list of things today because that's just not the vibes. So today's video is going to be a regular average day in my life as a girl in her 20s. Y'all know I have a couple of these on my channel and this is really just me living life as a girl in her 20s for real for real. So before we get any further in this video, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Do that button so you guys can be notified every time your girl posts. And with all that being said, let's just get right into it. Although I'm not gonna be doing too, too much today, I do still have a few things that I wanna get done today. For one, I need to go ahead and get up and get my life together. Two, I wanna go get me some breakfast and a coffee because for one, I'm starving and I really have a taste for a coffee. I also wanna go to Dollar Tree and get some cleaning supplies. Surprisingly, I do not have to clean my apartment up like my kitchen is clean my room is clean but i do want to sometime today wash my sheets and then i want to deep clean my shower so a lot of times when i clean my bathroom i basically just do like surface level cleaning and like obviously i'll clean my tub clean like my counters and stuff really good but i never really get down to the nitty gritty and clean out my shower i want to take everything off of the little shower caddies clean those clean my shower really good so i want to go to dollar tree and get a bucket so i can kind of like make a mop bucket because i don't have a mop bucket anymore I don't have a mop bucket anymore because we ended up throwing it away, which that's something that I also do need to get. But I do have a Swiffer Sweeper that's kind of been holding me over until I get a new one. What is that beeping? Can y'all hear that? I don't know what that's about. I need to edit a video and try to finish it today. But I'm not going to post it today. But I either want to try to finish it either today or tomorrow. But I may have a client in the morning. Uh, I'm still kind of iffy with that. But if I do have a client in the morning, I'm going to have to go to the hair store, get the hair set up for the client and all that stuff. Um, I was going to make breakfast today and go to the gym. But honestly, y'all, I'm really not feeling it. And I'm starting to listen to my body, y'all. I'm just in the era of listening to my body and not forcing. Like, it's okay to force yourself to be productive sometimes. But being someone like me who's always on go, always busy, I want to, like, cherish the time where I have time to just chill and relax and not just be on go 24-7, seven days a week all the time. Because that's honestly not healthy for your body. So, yeah. So, what I'm about to go ahead and do now is go ahead and get up do something with my hair, wash my face, brush my teeth, get ready for the day, throw on some clothes. Like I said, it's really gloomy out. So honestly, I may keep on this shirt and put some sweats on y'all because I'm really literally just going to go out there and give me some food and come back home. So I may just go ahead and keep this shirt on and put some sweats on and then we're going to go ahead and go get us some food and go get us some coffee. I do not know what type of food I want because it is still breakfast time. I don't got to worry about getting no lunch early in the morning because it is still breakfast time. So I'm really happy about that. I was thinking about going to this place I used to go to to get a breakfast burrito. So I may get that. Only thing is that and the coffee place is not next to each other at all. And it's like, do you really want to go on two different sides of town just to get some food and then get to get a coffee? Like, I don't know if that really makes sense. Anyways, with all that being said, I feel like I've kind of yapped enough and kind of went over what's really going to be happening in this video. So I'm about to go ahead and get up, get my life together, and I guess we'll just regroup once we are ready to leave the house. flat iron these bundles so as you can see they're like more in the straight aspect and i love this because it looks super natural y'all i was actually thinking about taking this hair out because i just cannot maintain the curls that easily like i feel like with it in the straight 
well, it's like semi-straight. Like, ever since I kind of like straightened it out a little more, I feel like it'll be more manageable because now I can like braid it up and just put it like in a cute braid. And then I feel like it matches my natural hair more. Only thing is I do have a track that's like slipping on this side, but I mean, it's not that big of a deal. But I feel like this looks so natural. Like y'all can't tell me it's not my hair. But anyway, so yeah, I just went ahead and fixed my hair. I told y'all I kept on this gray shirt and then I ended up throwing on some sweats. I got my slides on. I'm about to go ahead and go get us some breakfast. So I think I'm gonna just end up going to McDonald's, something real chill. And then I'm gonna go get me a coffee. It is 9.55, so I gotta hurry up and go. So I just wanna come in here and give y'all a little update on what we got going on because y'all know y'all haven't seen me since I was just doing my skin and oral care. So I got my skin and oral care out the way, got my hair out the way, and now we're about to go get us some breakfast. Just got in the car and completely forgot about the fact that I need gas. I literally have 18 miles. Baby, where do you think you're going? Well, only 18 miles i mean you're probably gonna be able to get there and get home but don't think you about to run no extra miles without getting no gas so now i gotta go and get gas and hurry up because it's 10 o'clock and y'all know i'm still trying to make breakfast so i gotta hurry up and go give me some gas i really need to go get a car wash but y'all i think i'm about to chill out on the car washes and just let my car just do what it do because i'm so tired of getting a car wash and it literally raining the next day getting a car wash and birds pooping on my car as soon as i leave the car wash like i'm so i'm tired of that okay i'm tired of that i feel like either i need to get a membership or something because every time i get a car wash it's like i need to go back but i think i'm gonna just take a break with getting the car washes for real, for real maybe i'll go every once in a while and like vacuum the inside of my car but as far as cleaning the outside if y'all see me and my car look dusty please just mind your business and don't talk about me because i just cannot do that anymore like i just can't i'm so fed up with constantly washing my car washing my car washing my car now this was like a dream car or something and don't get me wrong like i know like cherish what you have to get blessed for what you want but i'm not gonna keep washing this car like i'm just not gonna keep doing it i'm, I'm tired i'm played out okay i just got gas y'all and now i'm outside of mcdonald's gonna get me some breakfast and i'm trying to see if i got a code or something because they gotta buy one breakfast sandwich get one for one dollar baby i don't need two breakfast sandwiches i guess i'll just redeem these hash browns yeah i'm gonna just redeem these hash browns that i got and then i'm gonna just get me my sandwich and i look you want a biscuit just like a plain biscuit um the code is seven six yes can i get a sausage mcmuffin thank you you too okay y'all so y'all know i just got my food and y'all basically just heard what i ordered now i'm about to be on the way to seven brew i wanted to come here first because breakfast is like getting down to crunch time and i really didn't want to miss it but now i'm about to go ahead and go to seven brew get my coffee and then i'm gonna be headed back home once i get back home i really think i'm gonna start editing like i told y'all i need to get this video done or i don't know if i'm gonna get it done done but it's only one day of footage so i don't really know like how long it'll really take for them but yeah so i'm on the way to seven brew okay y'all so i've actually just made it back home it is now 10 59 and i went and got me some food and i went and got me a coffee so y'all know from mcdonald's y'all heard what i ordered from mcdonald's i didn't record me actually ordering my coffee but i did get that blondie that i've been drinking for the past couple of days it's so good y'all mm, super super good i think once i eat my food i'm gonna actually go into getting editing done like as soon as possible so that I can go ahead and kind of get that out the way. Because I really don't want to be editing all day. And like I said, I'm probably just going to give myself like two and a half, maybe three hours at the most to edit. Or really just see like how much I can get done within that time span. So I think that's what I'm going to do. After I finish editing, we'll probably move on to the next thing. But I really don't know like what else I would have planned after that. Kind of just going to really be going with the flow. I did tell y'all that I need to clean up my shower. So I'll probably go back out and then head to like Dollar General or like Dollar Tree or something like that. So I can get the stuff for it. And then we'll get into cleaning that but as far as what we're gonna do right now is eat this breakfast because i'm starving i was telling y'all in a few vlogs ago that i wanted to go back to school like in the spring or like in the winter and stuff like that so i also do want to call the school and kind of like check up on my application and see what's going on with it because if i am going to do like a winter class i have to see like what classes that i want to take because i think like winter enrollment starts in like october maybe november and y'all know we are in september and it's almost like mid-september so i would really have to like figure out like what kind of class i want to take how many do i want to take and like 
is my fast going to cover it? Do I need to come out of pocket? Like, so I think I'm going to end up calling the school sometime today too. Like I said, just to figure out like the update on my application. I don't see me not getting accepted because I've already been in the school. Like I don't, I really don't see me not getting accepted. I don't see why that will happen. But I think they are still like worrying about the people that's in like the fall semester and dealing with them which is why I haven't really been like harassed them about it really because I know they're focusing on the fall semester which is why I was trying to like wait a little bit I'm gonna just call them and see if I can get like an update on it at least and see where they're at with the application because that's something that I really need to get on that I won't be able to apply for the classes or register for the classes right now but I at least want to know like what classes I want to take, when I want to take them, what day they will start so I can kind of get like my schedule aligned. Basically just see what I want to do with that. We're going to see how that goes. I'm going to just go ahead and eat my food. Once I finish this, I'll be getting some work done. My iPad is now like crashing and like going really slow. I'm about to go ahead and give my editing a break. I've gotten 23 minutes into the video and I don't know how long it's going to be because at the end of the video I have like a lot of like montages and stuff that obviously make it seem like you have a lot of footage that got to be cut down. So I don't know how long it's going to be but I've been like editing really detailedly throughout. So how I usually edit is I'll go ahead and chop up all my clips and then once I finish doing that to the whole video I'll go back then I'll add my sound effect transitions my text my music and all that stuff but what I've been doing is actually doing that throughout which is why it's been taking me longer but I like it this way because now I won't have to go back and do these things I'll just be like done when I'm actually done I'm loving how the video has turned out so far I'm really putting some thought and effort into it and I really think y'all are going to enjoy this video this video is going to be my first shorter video than usual um like I said I'm 23 minutes into it now but I don't know how long the ending part is going to be but I'm taking a break I'm gonna let my iPad just charge up because it is on 16 percent so I'm about to let my iPad just charge up and kind of rest. I'm about to go ahead and get up and actually run the Dollar Tree so I can pick up those cleaning things. So I have cleaning products, but I know for a fact I want to get a bucket. I was explaining this to y'all earlier. So I want to get a bucket. Uh, I want to get an all-purpose spray and kind of see like what type of... I don't know. I don't think they'll have one, but y'all know how people be using the squeegees for the shower doors. I want to see if I can find a squeegee. I'm hoping they have one, but I'm not too like sure that they will. So I don't want my expectations to be high because this is Dollar Tree we're talking about. Still really, really gloomy outside. It's 125. There's little to no sun out. Um, let's see if it's warmed up because it was cooler earlier. Okay, it's warmed up. It's now 81 degrees. So it's a little bit warmer now. So I guess that's good. Another thing I'm going to do before I leave is go ahead and throw these sheets in the washer. That way when I get back, it will be pretty much almost time for me to go ahead and put them in the dryer. But once I finish cleaning up and putting my sheets in the washer and everything like that, uh, me and my boyfriend are actually supposed to be going to the movies tonight. We were supposed to go around like 6 when he got off, but he thinks he's going to get off a little earlier. So... I'm going to look up some movie times and see what time we'll end up going. We're in between these two movies that came out. And I guess I'll just talk to y'all a little more about that like a little bit later on when we're about to go. But I know we're going to go to the movies. And then I don't know what we're thinking for dinner. Maybe just eat at the movies. Maybe get something and bring it to the movies and eat. I don't really know what we're thinking about dinner. Other than that, y'all, that's pretty much everything that's on my to-do list for real. This video was supposed to be a productive video, so I was supposed to do a lot of other things. But like I explained this morning, I really wanted to take today to be productive, but like a regular productive day. Not the whole list. Like, I just, I didn't have that in me to do all that today. I didn't have it in me to do all that today. And I really didn't want to, so... 
I do still need to call the school. I have not called the school yet, so that's another thing that I want to do. And then I know sometime today I actually want to get some journaling done and some content planning done. So those are the three things that I like need to get done other than editing. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna end up editing that video, like finishing it today, which is perfect. Even though I don't plan on posting it until like Sunday or Monday, and today's Thursday. I will post today because y'all know I normally post on Thursdays, but I just posted a video um three days ago tonight at six will make three days ago and yeah i mean i could but honestly i might i'm not even gonna say i'm not gonna post it i might post it it really just depends on what time i end up finishing it because it's already 127 so i might post it tonight so let me not even say i'm not because i am i hit 7k uh last week sometime last week and i'm at 7100 now 7113 to be exact so Thank you guys so much for 7100. Um, I really, really love y'all. Like, I have been seeing so much growth in my channel and all the comments, the sweet comments telling me to keep going no matter what. Y'all gonna always be with me. Like, I really, really love y'all. Like, I do not take anything for granted. I am grateful. When I say I am grateful to have y'all, grateful to have y'all. So thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all so much. I'm so irritated that I have not been celebrating my wins because they have been coming so fast but when we hit ak i'm gonna celebrate i'm gonna start thinking about what i actually want to do when i celebrate it obviously won't be too big because when i hit 10k oh baby i'm going big when i hit 10,000 subscribers y'all y'all just go ahead and get me there because i promise y'all when i hit 10,000 subscribers i'm celebrating probably the whole month that i hit 10,000 subscribers but when i hit 8k I just want to do a little bit of celebration. I might go get me some new charms, buy myself something nice. Like when I celebrate 8K, it's going to be a vibe. But when I celebrate 10K, yeah, I'm really going to be one of the ones for real, for real. But anyways, y'all, I could care less if I was still at 1K, 5K, 7K or 8K. I appreciate every single one of you guys. I love y'all so much. Like, I just love y'all so much. Y'all don't even understand. Let's go ahead and get up and strip these sheets off this bed, throw them in the washer, and then head to Dollar Tree so we can get going on. you guys y'all seen i had ended up running in there and running out and i got everything that i got from the store pretty much what i showed you guys is i got this bucket i think this is actually like a bowl that you can like cook with but i'm gonna use this as like a bowl to clean with then i got some gloves i can use to clean the bathroom i got this all-purpose bathroom cleaner now i do have other products as well like i have the pink stuff bathroom cleaner like that's like a foam cleaner i already have bleach i already have fabulosa i just needed a few more things that way i can like really get in the shower so i'm about to go ahead and start cleaning this shower i'm gonna take all of my stuff out of the shower like my body wash and all that stuff basically everything that's right here i'm gonna take all that off wipe down the caddies really really good i'm gonna get into like the creases and everything on the shower and then i'm gonna turn on my shower head i'm turning on my shower head and get like you know all the soap and shit off so i'm literally about to put soap all on these walls and all on the ground and all that so probably not gonna record the process though but y'all know i also have this shower cleaner the little shower thing, the handle part is not on there, but y'all know I have this, so this is what I'm actually gonna be using. I'm gonna go ahead and make my little concoction and make my little cleaning solution in here, and I'm gonna be dipping that brush in here and kinda like cleaning the bathroom and everything. I gotta go ahead and grab the Fabulosa, grab the bleach, grab all that, and basically, I'm gonna mix it all up in here. I might go ahead and clean my toilet too. My toilet is clean, but I feel like I'm already doing this, so I might as well just go ahead and get in the nitty gritty of my shower and my toilet 
And then other than that, um, I'm still waiting on my sheets to be done in the washer. They're still in the washer because I was literally gone for like maybe 10 minutes. They're still in the washer. So once they finish, hopefully by the time I finish cleaning up, that will be, oh damn, that's what I forgot to look. I forgot to see if they had a freaking shower squeegee, which I didn't see one. So I'm guessing they didn't have it, but I forgot all about that. It's okay. I'm going to just spray it down real good and wipe it real good. It's not even that big of a deal. I'm I'm gonna end up ordering one from Amazon because I do feel like that's something that I need to like make sure my door is clean because it looks crazy. Now I'm about to go ahead and start cleaning up and I'm gonna just see y'all afterwards. I'm gonna put something on my iPad that I can watch while I'm doing this and I'm gonna see y'all when I finish. So I'm finally done cleaning that freaking shower, y'all. As y'all can see, I am sweaty. My face is sweaty. My back is sweaty. My under is sweaty. I'm very sweaty. I'm going to take a shower, but I'm going to end up letting the chemicals kind of like air out before I get in the shower. It is very, very clean now. When I tell y'all, I was damn near on my hands and knees scrubbing the bottom of that tub. I was just really cleaning, like deep cleaning, as y'all seen, like deep cleaning the whole shower because it's been needing to be done. The only thing I will say is, it's, it was kind of hard to clean like the door. I think the Windex isn't strong enough. I really think I need to get like the foam window cleaner because that glass cleaner is not really doing the job. Like I was able to pretty much get it clean, but I don't know if y'all can tell, but at the bottom it's still like not really to my liking how I would have wished it was. But for now it's cool. I'm ready to be done cleaning. I put the sheets in the dryer and now my comforter is in the washer. So that's good. I'm about to go ahead and wash my hands and just kind of chill out for a little bit so I can cool off. And then once these chemicals and everything like get out of the bathroom, I'm gonna go ahead and take my shower. I think in the meantime, I'm about to hit back on my video and see if I can get some more work done. Yeah, y'all, my hair done poofed up and everything. That's how hot it is. Uh, my boyfriend is on the way, so when he get here, we're going to talk about... Oh, he's actually pulling up. So whenever he comes in, I'm going to talk to him about maybe getting lunch and then figuring out what time we're going to go to the movies. And then from there, that's when I'll kind of like pick up the camera and let y'all know pretty much what's going on. But for right now, I'm kind of looking at my list and seeing what else needs to be done. I washed my comforter, cleaned out my shower. I just got to finish editing my video, plan some content and journal. So I don't know if I'm going to do all that right now. Well, I know for a fact I'm going to start editing again, but I don't know if I'm going to plan content and journal just yet. But for right now, your girl just need to cool off, y'all. I'm I'm literally so sweaty i honestly didn't really think it was gonna take as long as it did to clean it up but i'm just glad i was able to really get it done and get it clean as much as i would like to so it's a little bit later on i'm about to go ahead and go to the movies but i just got the shower and got dressed i just threw on this black not two-piece set but i wear like a two-piece set this shirt is from fashion over these tights are from february 21. i grabbed my movie bag because y'all know i'm gonna throw me some snacks in here and i'm gonna throw my drink in here i'm about to go ahead and go the movie starts at 4 45 well that's what time the preview start and i think it's like 4 30 now i was pre-watching this video y'all and i am literally in love with this video it is coming out super super good i low-key kind of like finished it but i still want to add a few more things to it because i'm having so much fun with this video and this is why i be telling y'all like when y'all edit you gotta have fun with the videos like i could edit this video 
yesterday or like two days ago but like i wasn't in the mood to edit and honestly when you're not in the mood to edit it definitely shows with your videos and shows like you just trying to rush and hurry up and get it done but now that i've actually been taking my time with it and having fun with it it's coming out so good and i'm literally so excited for y'all see it if y'all have not watched my productive day in the life becoming a productive princess video go watch it because it's a great video in my opinion it's a great video but anyways my boyfriend's waiting on me i know he's probably like girl come on so I'm about to go ahead and put my iPad back on the charger and we're going to be headed out. Okay, y'all. So we are about to be pulling up to the movies. I ended up bringing me a jacket and I brought me some socks because my feet is out and I want to put my socks on like in a the movie theater. We got some popcorn that we made at the house just because I be feeling like this popcorn is a little bit better than the movie popcorn. And I bought me a drink that I had because the movie theater charged you $10 for a drink. I'm ODing, but they still be charging a lot for a drink. I'm gonna just end up getting me some food and then he gonna get whatever he gonna get. And we're gonna end up watching a movie. We're watching um 1992, I think. Or Blink Twice. I don't remember which one it is, but we watching. He said we watching 1992, but I could have sworn he said we was watching Blink Twice. Whichever one we watching, they both look really, really good. And I've heard good things about both of them, so I'm not really tripping on whichever one it is. And I'm excited to watch the movie. And I don't think it's gonna be a lot of people there either because it's like really early. Like nobody really comes to the movies at five o'clock. Preview should be over like as soon as we walk in there. So we gotta hurry up and get in, get our seat, and get seated down. But yeah, little movie date. left the movies and now we are on the way back home that movie was very weird like it was something it was just weird it's a weird movie i'm not gonna say it was bad but it was just a weird movie but i mean i give it like a six what'd you give it um yeah six seven i don't know it was yeah, just it was the end was good the end of the movie was good but like leading up to it it was like bro what's going on it was making me so mad the character was irritating the end of the movie was good uh the lighting is like y'all see how the lighting is i apologize but we're on the way back home when i get back home i'm gonna finish editing that video and then after that i don't really know what i'm gonna do after that but i'm gonna finish editing that video and go ahead and get that saved i guess we'll be figuring something else out after that Good morning, y'all. It is the next day. I just finished getting up and getting ready for the day. Last night, I stayed up pretty late to about like midnight and I'll finish editing that video that I was telling y'all that I was editing yesterday. And while I finished editing that video around like, as soon as we had got back from the movies yesterday, I finished editing the video because I was telling y'all like I was pretty much done with it. I finished editing that video. It is now scheduled to post, title, thumbnail, and everything is done for. Once I had finished editing that video, I actually started editing this one and I edited it all the way up into the point where y'all literally had just seen yesterday's clips. And I noticed that I never came back on the camera and in the video off. So I definitely apologize about that. I was just so proud of myself that I was able to finish two videos in one day. And I mean, don't get me wrong, both of the videos are not that long, but it's just, I'm still proud of myself that I was able to get that done. So I did want to come back on here because for one, I never got around to content planning and journaling. So I want to do that this morning. And then I just want to go ahead and end this video off for real because I really don't want this one to be too, too long. But I do want to definitely get that content planning and journaling out the way because that's something that I did want to get done in this video. So that's what I'm going to do this morning. I was just about to make me some breakfast, but when I tell you I need to go grocery shopping because I literally have nothing in here to make. I tried to make some pancakes. We barely had any milk. We probably got this much milk left. And I didn't want to make my pancakes with no uh, water or nothing. And then we don't have no eggs. We don't have nothing in here. I don't have no yogurt to eat. I just got a bag of granola. I don't got no fruit. I don't got no French toast. Baby, you're going to need to go grocery shopping. Like ASAP. I need to go grocery shopping. Because I'm probably just going to end up eating something else. Some noodles or something a little bit later on. We don't have nothing for me to eat right now. So I definitely need to go grocery shopping one of these upcoming days. But I'm not doing it today. So I went ahead and grabbed my self-care journal and this is what i'm going to be using to journal today it is the self-care journal and this one has like daily templates for you to use basically 
So I'm gonna use this to journal today and then I'm gonna be using my iPad to content plan. So I got my iPad and my Apple Pencil and I'm just gonna be planning content on my notes app. Nothing really too major for real. But yeah, I'm gonna start with journaling first. And I don't know how long I'm gonna journal. I'm just gonna go through a few templates and kind of just write. And then once I feel like I'm done, I'm gonna move on to content planning and then that'll be it for real, for real. Did my journaling and everything for a couple minutes and then i have planned about 10 videos which obviously they all won't be in the month of september but i have some videos for september and then some videos for october so really excited about that but i do feel like i got pretty much everything that i wanted to get done for this video super proud of myself for being able to get everything done especially since y'all know i got two videos done because I'm actually about to go ahead and finish this video up. So I'm going to post this one on YouTube. So we'll have two videos on YouTube scheduled to post. And I'm going to have to worry about editing. All I can do is start filming my next video. So, But anyways, y'all, I really, really do love y'all. I appreciate you guys so, so much for subscribing to my channel. If you have not already, make sure you subscribe. Because I promise, I promise, I promise we are going up. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And ding that button so you guys can be notified every time your girl posts. And with all that being said, I'm going to go ahead and see y'all in the next video. Bye.